Hello students, today I would like to introduce a new poem, Solitude, written by, there is other name, Ella Wheeler Wilcox, a woman, written Solitude, Ella Wheeler Wilcox. Okay, she was born in 1850 and was died in 1990, was an American author and poet, okay. She is belonged to America. Who is that? Ella Wheeler Wilcox. She is belonged to America. Her best known work is Poem of Passion. Her most enduring work of is Solitude, which is contains some of quoted lines. But his most important work, according to this, is Solitude, is her prestigious poem. Okay, her autobiography, The World and I Was, published in 1918, a year before her death. All right. She also wrote her autobiography that is uh, named The Wolves and I was published in the year 1918, a year before her death. So that's about Ella Wheeler Wilcox, American poet. Uh, this is a brilliant work of Ella Wheeler Wilcox. So what do you mean by solitude? Solitude means lonely. That's it. Solitude means lonely. That means Malayalam Egandada. Right. Okay. Uh, I think uh, some of them like solitude way of thinking, solitude uh, style of life. Uh, some of them don't like solitude style of life. Okay. How many of them is like solitude? Is the solitude is necessary in our life? Okay, let us see. That means uh, in our life, we have we want to pass. We will pass different st stage of our life. Is it? Sometimes it's happy stage of life. Sometimes it's sad, sad, sad of life. Sometimes frustration. Sometimes what is it? Uh, angry in mood. Sometimes we are in helpless situation. So various situations we want to past in our life. Life is not always happy, is it? Life is not always sad, is it? It's a mixture of both. It's just like a pendulum, you know, clock pendulum, wall clock pendulum, all the wall clock, not modern, all the wall clock, there is a pendulum is there, a round shape one. It's, a, well, it's a, a moving from one side to another side. One side to another side, one side to another side. That is called pendulum. So life is also just like that. That means what? It is not stand in one. It is moving. Sometimes it's life in good. Sometimes life in bad. Sometimes we are happy. Sometimes we will are not happy. We are we will get sorrow. So this is a life. Life we cannot say that is stand on happy. We cannot say that stand in sad. It's a process it's a process life is a process we want to face this challenge of life that is exactly we want to face that is life we want to face and overcome this challenge of life then only we would like to be say that uh, a perfect woman or man that is the meaning of life uh, we want to face we everyone want to think about what that i want happy always in morning to evening, or this month to next month, or this year to next year, this moment to this moment, we want happy. Everybody dream like that. Everybody wish like that. Everybody cherish that. But it is not like that. Life is that pendulum. That means the process of sometimes come happy, sometimes come sad. What kind of life is you like? Is it sad mood life or happy life? Definitely, most of them said that, that most of them believe that I want a happy life. That means we are afraid to face the challenge of life. Is it? So we should have to overcome the challenge of life. For example, if you are happy, everybody with you. If you are smiling, everybody with you. But if you are crying, maybe nobody with you. If you are in sorrow, nobody with you. If you are in uh, disturbance, nobody with you. That's a lifestyle, is it? Except one or two, maybe your help. I don't uh, say that everybody like that. 
maybe someone will help you but it's exactly when we are laugh everybody with you when we are sad nobody with you that means you are alone and that exactly we want to face these kinds of atmosphere in our life we can't say that i want only happy situation exactly we want to follow these two types of or different feelings in our life you can imagine that no every day sometimes your day is different from other day sometimes you are frustrated sometimes you are very angry in that day other day you are maybe very cheerful happy i uh, like that way so that is a situation so what's the point here said that we want to overcome the challenge of life we should have confident in order to success in our life we should possess confident we should possess courage we should be self reliant self reliant mean swayam paryaptada areyum aasrayikade swantham kaali nilkanulla kai that is called self reliant if you are self reliant definitely you became confident and definitely then you became happy everyone with you that means poet said that each should be positive thinking not negative thinking should have a optimistic not pessimistic okay should have a optimistic think that means everything good i will overcome that i will pass the examination i will get more marks i will get good job all is your thinking should be positive way not in the way of negative similarly you should possess confident courage and also you should have to face the challenge of life if you are confident if you are courage you can easily overcome the challenge of life then you became self reliant then you will become happy then everyone with you and your friends relatives everyone with you if you are sad according to poet what nobody with you nobody come with you nobody move with you nobody touch with you that is the things in our world the present world is like that if you have money so many people are comes with you if you have no money maybe nobody with you that is a present world present world everybody most of them were selfish not everyone most of them are selfish they are not ready to help others they are not ready to accept the pain of others they are not ready to accept the agony or sorrow of others if that particular person is sorrow everyone comes in distance but if you are happy if you have money every friends and with you and you are enjoy within party and everywhere if you are silently sit in a place and cry you are in mood of maybe nobody have to listen to you that is a present world according to our poet that means here poet is ella wheeler wilcox said like this that is a summary of this poem you understand students all right and also this is our last chapter after that the la- first chapter onwards we are on to uh same classes will be repeated that one you listen this again the same classes from from first to this last after we want to go to revision and we want to ask some questions and before that you should have to complete your entire notes and you have to submit show in my whatsapp number the same mobile number is my whatsapp number you should have to each should have to uh, write your roll number and the name and also show your notebook i mean picture to my whatsapp number that is another attempt understood so you must be ready to write every note every chapter's notebook in every chapter's note in your notebook are you ready yes if you don't write within time it will be a great problem to you after you didn't get c marks and it will be great problem with you. then it's a diff- difficult for you after that uh, you may be maybe too much lazy it will cause for too much distractions in your uh, studies so write the notes properly so this is the last chapter and you should be continue from first onwards and you should be ready for that again you have to listen the first class onwards same class you should be uh, listen that one after we want to discuss about the uh, what revisions all right 
So let us start. Solitude. Okay, what is that? Solitude says about what? Let us see what is solitude. Okay. A laugh. Okay, sorry. Don't you wish to have someone beside you when you are sad? Yes. Okay, that means that is the things. Don't you wish to have someone beside you when you are sad? That means when you are sad, you don't want anybody with you because you want to cry, maybe. You want to think, maybe. You want alone. Are sad or in distress. Do you be re ready to help uh, others when they are in need? Yes. Are you ready to help the sorrowing people, helpless people, crying people? Now let us read what the poet has taken notice of about the world we live. Yes, in read. That means we want to let us read what the poet had has taken notice. What's the poet said that? What's the present world people do when they are alone, when they are sorrow, when they are happy? See that. Laugh and the world will laugh with you. Yes, if you laugh, everybody with you. World will laugh means every people with you. Maybe your friends, relatives, family members, everyone with you. When when you are laugh, then weep. Weep means crying. That means different type of crying. Okay, and you weep alone. Nobody with you. No friends. No relative. No. The parents maybe know with you all you all alone you have to suffer in that at that time. For this sad old earth must borrow its mirth. Even the earth also not help you. Even the world or earth also not help you. That is the thing said it. Is it okay? The first line is said that what is that? The present world people are only interested in sharing happiness and joy. Joy means happy. Same. With them, with others, sorrow are to be faced all alone. This shows selfishness. That means when you are sad, nobody with you. When you are happy, everybody with you. That is the first two three lines says about that. Even earth also not support with you. That means earth also avoid you. That is the meaning of that. Borrow is myth. Myth means desire. But uh, has trouble enough of its own. Okay. Sing and the hills will answer. Sigh is lost on the air. The echoes bond to joyful sound, but shrink from voicing care. That means this line says about what? When you are happy, everybody with you. When you are sad, nobody with you. Even nature also, hill, mountain, stream, river, or what is called as here. Earth, nobody with you. All are avoid you. That is the modern world, according to poet. That is the present world. That means only the happy people have supported with you during the time of sad. Nobody with you. Even the nature, even the stream, even the river, even the lady, nobody with you. That is the says about that. That means people are not selfishness. That is the shows about the selfishness of the people. But maybe some good friends you have, you are lucky. They may be. Relax you when you are sad. I think it's a, some of you have a good friend, is it? Or nobody have a good friends? It depends upon you. Okay, right? But poet says that most of them are selfishness. Okay. There are uh, what is it? Uh, many to share a person joy, but but none to comfort him or unhappy ones. Nobody come and say that. Okay, don't worry. You don't cry. Uh, yeah, everything is okay. Nobody said that, according to poet said. Everybody is, uh, if you are uh, crying or we weep, if you are in sad mood, if you have no money, if you have lost your property, if you have lost your was someone, and uh, nobody will come with you and say, "Don't worry," say that. So that's why poet said that most of them were selfish. For the sad, all the earth also. What say earth doing? Earth also, don't help you. Don't relieve you. Okay, even natural also. That is a full stanza says about this. Up to but shrink from voice gap. Okay, success alone can motivate the live and sharing the joy. Only if you are success in your life, everybody with you, then you are happy with you. Okay, our success can promote for uh, him or her only. Promote harmony. Only you are success. Only everybody with you. 
If your success only everyone with you, you can create happy, you can create friends, you can create harmony. That means friendship, everything. If your success, if you fail, everybody is away with you. Everybody is far away with you. So that is the things in the present world, according to poet. Okay. Okay then, rejoice and men will seek you. Rejoice means happy. Grieve, grieve means sad. And they turn and go. That means if you are happy, everybody with you. If you are grief, sad, nobody have to turn. Nobody have to come and see you. Okay, that's the meaning. Okay, they want full measure to all your pleasure. Everyone want happy. Pleasure means here happy. They means here your friends or relatives. But they do not need your woe. Woe means here sad. Don't want to see the sadness. Be glad and your friends are many. Yeah, if you are glad, if you are happy, glad means happy, friends are, too much friends are come with you. If you have money, too much friends are come with you. If you are sad, if you have no money, you lose them all. Them means your friends. Who oh, is the them? Maybe ask the question. You should be say that that's the friends. That means if the friends are distant, if you have money, if you have no money, if you are sad. Uh, there are none to decline your, neck, that means necrated wine. But alone you must drink your let's call. Here, the very good word is that. What is that? Nectared uh, wine. Nectared wine means, what is that? Maduramulla wine. That means, uh, what is that? Uh, ten. Yes, nectared means ten. That means, here nectared wine means happy moments. Happy moments. Not moments. Moments. Happy time. That is the word meaning of nectared wine here. Maduramulla samayam. Madhuramulla Samya means, Madhuramulla wine means, what is that? Happy moment. That means happy time. Everybody with you. When? If you are gal, gal means, that means, a dis, that means a disappointment, frustration, angry, dull, sad. That is the word, word, of, word meaning of gal. Okay? So, that is the word meaning. What is a, here is the word meaning of nectated wine means? Happiest moment, moment, no, moment, time. Then at the same time, but alone you must be drinking your life, girl, means your frustrated time, your bad time, your sad time. Okay, okay. That means here again say that if you are happy, everyone with you, if you are sad, nobody with you. Okay, I will give you this content again. But one, one by one, we must, I'll SEL file on through this narrow SEL of pain. That means, if you are pain, nobody with you. If you are happy, everybody with you. You being a self-reliant, then what is that? If you are self-reliant, everybody with you. I told self-reliant, if you have money, property, car, bungalow, uh, friends, you have too much shops, your business in outside, then everybody with you. You self-reliant, you have much money and property. You don't want to depend on others. That is called self-reliant. Help us to overcome the problems. If you are self-reliant, I already told. If you are self-reliant, you can overcome everything. According to poet. Okay. According to poet, if you are self-reliant, everybody come with you. Happy come with you. Friends come with you. Then you have courage and then you are confident. Then you became a self successful man or successful girl. That when you are only self-reliant, okay. Then you can face your challenge according to poet. When when you are self-reliant, okay? Then only you can face the challenge of life. I already taught so many challenges in our life, okay? All right, then what is next? Okay, then feast and your hill, uh, halls are crowded. Yes, if you conduct a party, feast means here party. Everyone comes and join with you, drink, eat, dance, everything. Fast, the whole world goes away. If you are fasting, you don't, you have no money, you have no money, you are fasting, you don't eat, you don't like to drink, you don't like to dance, you don't have party, nobody with you. Okay? Everybody gone, everybody goodbye. That means every of friends you have didn't attract you. Okay? Succeed and give. If you are success, I told you, if you are self-reliant, everyone with you. And it helps you live. Yes, that's you have getting some motivation. If you are success, 
you you don't think about death you don't think about worry you don't think about any other thing if you are success everybody with you then you think that this is life this is a happy moments okay how to became success you became a self reliant okay but no man can help you die but when you are dying time nobody has to comes and sleep with your uh, graveyard is it we are gone alone in our death no wife no children go with him or go with her is it only he alone goes uh, go into in front of the god right that time nobody has to go okay there is a room in the hall of flesh room in the hall of pleasure mean pleasure mean that's happiest time for a long and a loudly train okay but one by one you must file on through the narrow assail of pain assail means near if you have pain everybody have avoided you one by one avoided you because you have pain now you are sore now you have no money now so everybody has avoided you right so that is a world system according to our beloved american poet elia wheeler wilcox so do you understand that okay here again i want to contend is that you to be would uh, uh, some content is there uh, a sales which is us only when we are happy that means everybody come when you are happy nobody share our sorrows nobody like to share our sorrow things everybody like to share our happy moments but nobody like to share our sorrows sorrows means sad okay here i already told nectar wine means here happiest moments time okay then life's gain means sorrows of our life sorrow means sad the theme of the poem what is the theme of the poem the theme of the poem is sorrows oh, oh, sorry to stay positive people will with you if you stay if you live positively if you live with the positive thinking what do you mean by positive thinking everything good i will uh, definitely get a good job i will overcome the difficulty i will pass the examination i will uh, what's that swim the river just like a confidence you need that means stay positivity then everybody with you that is a the theme stay positivity that means live positively don't think any negative way okay that is a the theme of the poem to stay positive people will with you that is a the theme of the poem okay next tone what is the tone of the poem tone of the poem is optimistic optimistic means what shiva apti vishwas optimistic be optimistic don't pessimistic optimistic opposite is pessimism all right should be be optimistic don't pessimist okay that is a tone optimistic be optimistic is a tone of the poem then what is speaker's outlook line speaker says some outlook in this line what is the outlook what is the line of the speaker's uh, favorite uh, line is here rejoice and a man will seek you that means if you happy everybody with you if you positive everybody with you that is a uh, advice given by poet that means you should have positive thinking you should have happy you don't worry about the sad then nobody with you right so be positivity be confident be self reliance then only everyone with you that's about this so that's about the ending of our chapters so uh, solitude means loneliness okay uh, 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 one uh, let me alone that's a thing okay i already thought that means if you want to the activity and question answer you should have to visit the site what is that hss live or live guru kerala state syllabus that the kerala state board that is the uh things you have to click you can get the every chapters answers that means hss live guru that means gate you should have to write the gate hss live guru gate book is you getting almost all question answer and activity activity you should have to completed in your textbook and other things i already told in the first class is so you should have to possess a notebook and should be write very neatly it should be a college book it should be write very neatly and in the first pages there is too much lines you there first chapter you write from one page how many pages you written 
and there is a signature column i want to sign that column you don't sign that one and in the up you can write your roll number and the name and class don't write in the middle of the pages your class and the name and everything okay i want to check it that one okay so definitely you should submit the note in front of me my whatsapp okay don't forget about that one here the question is the theme of the poem which is the theme there is option is there if you stay positive people will be be with you that is a theme if you stay positive you will be became successful which one i told it uh, theme of the this is a theme i already told the theme is it to stay positive yes to stay the, sorry this to stay positive people will be with you okay that one same okay next is the tone of the poem i already told optimistic then which line of the poem is described the speaker is the outlook of the life i already told rejoice and men will seek you so so many question and this and the activity is also there so do one thing you should have to write this then can what is that can here can means what is that ability you can what you can i can successful in our life i can jump the sea jump into the sea right i can climb the uh what's that coconut tree very fast way i can write left hand also okay so so many things can we can use there i can do what are the things we can do is there can after can you should have to use first form of a verb i can do i can play i can study i can uh, what eat i can drink don't write i can played i can study don't write okay so that is the things you must remember when you are can use any subject you can use he can she can we can they can every any subject you can use can use then this next can not verb can is modal auxiliary verb modal auxiliary verb can could may might shall will should etc we can call as modal auxiliary verb exact verb is i can after the word will which one is come that is a verb he said do i can do homework that mean do is the main verb i can play cricket which is the uh, verb play is the verb then what is the uh, can can is modern auxiliaries for is can use can used for in order to show our ability okay can also we can use for permission possession and everything we can use that that's another things okay so that's the end of our chapter is it so too much meaning is and everything so remember next class onwards the same classes the first classes will comes in front of you don't worry after you have to read then we want to start one by one class finish after we will start our revision revision start means you must be studied the compact compartment that means chapters or lesson then we will discuss these things your doubts i will clear for you then we then only this is called we are revision okay so that is our procedure not now that one that is after again we have to go starting our first book from first text chapter that is you can get it from the next class after this class you can get it like that you don't worry after that you don't say in message that i didn't get to the class or like that one okay you can anything you can personally mention in my whatsapp right all right okay have a doubt also you can ask in my whatsapp number right okay so you know you should have to show your notebook that mean a uh, one chapter one chapter one chapter wise not all notebooks okay so same whatsapp number phone number so whats number is the same okay so that is the things i already said it here so last chapter solitude written by ella american poet you understood what is that what is the tone of the poem what is the theme of the poem what is the meaning of the poem what is it says about uh, what is happy what is sad what is life what is the change uh, challenge of life we already said is you understood that one is it yes that is the things we want to know that okay solitude is finished so i think you are happy with me so if you have any doubt you can ask my phone number you know that 
and definitely you should have to complete your notebook okay then only i will be happy we want to get more marks okay so you can ask any doubts i will clear for you clear that all right so that's all today take care bye